My name is Vivek Paul. I live in Bombay. Uh, I've spent about 20 years around media entertainment business. And as I was moving in to the, uh, you know, the next phase of my career, one, one of the things that I was looking at was where would I find the next co-founder? And where would I get the right kind of education or the right kind of environment that would gel with the thought process that I have? And suddenly we were in, in this technology evolution and I was able to connect to something which was online. I read Future of Music book some time ago. Uh, at that point in time, I was not sure I would take Berkeley. But when I actually came down and studied Berkeley and I, I did Mike's class, I, I think that set the foundation for even the business models that I had. I worked with an independent artist, uh, five degrees uh, out of Dubai. There was such a budding artist right at the bottom of the pyramid of the music industry who's struggling to create performances and then revenue. Uh, and I used the whole Berkeley course, including Top Spin Media, as profiling that artist. And in real time example, we went and executed a whole lot of stuff using the Berkeley tools that were available to me in different modules. That was interesting thing for me to learn from Berkeley. How do you engage social with, uh, you know, artist-based, independent artist-based uh, products? The second thing that I was working on was brand music technology. You know, for me, that was the big idea. And I wrote the first business plan in a class. The whole business plan was written in that. The execution of that was actually that's a globally first hybrid application. That's what I was building, you know, and I wanted to build it with Sony. Uh, so I used Sony Music's catalog and I excited Sony mobile devices on top of that. It's the first hybrid application. So it eliminates the pain of go to iTunes and download or go to Spotify and stream. Hybridization was becoming the next big thing. And that's, that's the thing that got validated for me in the class. I think I was living the idea. And I, the, the beauty of the education for me was while I was living the idea, I was actually getting it validated. I think there is a huge amount of gap for the whole creative industry to be educated. Uh, you know, a whole lot of people are not educated. They don't understand rights. They don't understand what they're capable of. They don't understand credibility. And I think in, in a snapshot, what I can say, the big transformation is that song is an IP, uh, artist is a brand. If you put both of them together, it's a startup. The big thing that I learned at Berkeley, you know, which kind of validated for me that music has an emotional connect. So every time you're listening to music, you're reliving a story that you have around yourself. I think music lives forever. You know, it, it kind of goes from birth to death for you. And as you kind of keep listening, your favorite songs are actually your favorite moments of life, you know. And uh, everybody is involved with music. It's just that a few people take it as a passion and make it a career. The fundamental and the bottom line was that what would I think Berkeley Online Music was? I think that was a co-founder for me in my whole business plan.